How's your feeling of that coming to Chengdu right now? Oh, I'm, I'm very excited. It's, uh, you know, I was here maybe about three or four months ago. No, I was, I was very excited to come back to Chengdu again. And uh, I was here last, I think, end of March. Um, so, you know, usually when I come to Chengdu, one of the big hallmarks of Chengdu is to get your ears cleaned at the ear spa. Yeah, so, the ear massage. That's yeah. right. I, I went and that was a really, really unique experience. And I haven't been back, but I hope I will be able to do that this time. Then my hearing will get better. Great. So what's about this time's impression compared with the last time you went to Chengdu? Well, this time, you know, we've all been very busy, uh, you know, watching all the films and, uh, you know, doing our job to select the best. Uh, I've, I've been involved in the documentary category, so we've sort of looked at some of the best films that have been made in the documentary category from in China and outside. Some really great work from China, actually, uh, amongst the international mix. So it's been a very exciting couple of days uh, to be able to select the best films. Also, yesterday, you know, I was able to meet one of my personal heroes, Jiang Yimou. Wow. So he came to see us. Um, I was involved in a project uh, which was the Winter Olympics opening ceremony and uh, you know the, we, we did a show around that but that time I only met him through rushes right I only saw him as images uh, to, to, to sort of watch and then put into the show but that's why it was really exciting as the chairman of the jury to be able to see him yesterday and shake hands so that was great fun. Wow, great. So how's your feeling of enjoy these kind of documentaries? Is there any documentaries you like the most? I think, you know, I was saying earlier that it's great to, to be with an international panel, uh, mm -hmm. with, with some old friends and some new friends who've come because, you know, the pandemic is over and now travel is more easy. So it was wonderful to sit uh, with an international group of people, also some old Chinese friends who were also part of the jury and watch some really fantastic films from all over. Um, I think we all get extremely busy in our daily lives making TV that we forget the joys of actually watching some great work together as a group. And that's both invigorating and relaxing at the same time. I, and I think that's why it's been great fun to be in Chengdu this time uh, and, and uh, relax in, in China's iconic panda city and also to meet Bebe, you know. Good yeah. to see you. Fantastic. Good to see you. Yeah. So, how's your feeling about communicating with Bebe? Is it relaxing, isn't it? Yeah, Is there always. any other impressions Absolutely. of Bebe? Absolutely. Yeah. And like I was saying, you know, um, when I see panda eyes, uh, I look at my own eyes and say, great, we are all TV professionals. And because we love our jobs, we hate to sleep because we're always so excited. I see that by looking into Bebe's eyes. Thank you so much. And would you like to follow our cameraman and take a group photo? Sure. Xiong Mao Guan Cha.